Shalom guys, I hope that you are doing well. Thanks for joining for our daily reading. I hope everyone had a fantastic weekend and all of that kind of stuff. Happy birthday, happy anniversary, and love and light to anyone who is down and out and is pressing through. Just keep on keeping on, man. If you're new, my name is Shannon. I'm glad to have you. I read tarot a lot different than a lot of people. It's intense here. Anything goes, the good, the bad, the ugly, the nasty, and we deal with it. Okay, we're asking at the hand of the great one, and uh, he brings things to the surface. What you do with this energy is your business. Okay, hopefully you'll want to look in the mirror and fix things and, um, you know, come alive by way of the truth. Um, the, we, we, list, we look at all kinds of criminal activity here, and you will just hear stuff that can be disturbing to you. Uh, I do incorporate the scripture because it's found in the tarot, but I'm not a religious channel or a religious person. Um, but uh, I do love Yehovah Elohim with all my heart, with all my strength, with all my soul. I keep all ten of the commandments, and uh, we, we judge by that because we're supposed to, okay? Uh, it's light to us. There is no other light outside the law of Yehovah and his um, commandments. And so, anyway... Welcome if you stay. If you got to go away, I guess you got to go away. Thanks for checking me out. <clears throat> Y'all are going to have to excuse my hands. I don't have no fingernails on them at this time. And so it is what it is. And so if you are new, I'm just very transparent. I'm a real person. And so you get to see all sides of me. And I'm just not superficial. <laughs> I'm just not. So, uh, but anyway, just, but I do want to say my hands don't look that great today because I took my nails off. So anyway, <clears throat> until another video, they'll be fixed. All right, you hope Elohim, I appreciate you so very much. Thank you for the great Hamashiach, the Christ who lives inside of us, who is the head, who has, you know, ascended and fill, fills the whole universe. He just fills all things within us. Let us enter into these gates with thanksgiving in our heart to you. Open the gates of righteousness to us, Jehovah, to speak right, to do right today to uh, have wisdom and knowledge and understanding. We ask for your wisdom today. We need it. Oh, we need it. We need your shield. We need you to be our buckler. We need you to be our rear reward. We just need you. Oh, we can't do anything outside of Yeshua. Let us stay in the vine. Let us just stay in the vine. Oh, what do you want to bring out here? All right. <clears throat> the star. Yes, this was in the next 24 hours when we looked last night when we... Uh, uh, was reading okay something's going to be known today spoken or is already if there's bitterness the star on the negative is bitterness okay and there's some type of an attacking i guess so somebody gonna have to knows that they've got to um you know stand up here and guard something as well then we get in a victory somebody knows somebody's got a victory over some type of a situation as well why am i saying i know <laughs> or we know or somebody knows if you're new the love of their motto is i know okay it's information it's exposure it's speaking it's the pictograph of the mouth here there is some type of speaking and communication and quick travel and an investigation as well here um <clears throat> something very passionate in here something's going to be set ablaze here so we get um air and fire together and there's a there's there's something just blazing out here show me the star give us more information today there was a message there for the 24 hour period uh that we were looking at and the law was also there in that reading as well show us the, show us the information then you'll because it's coming in quick <clears throat> thank you the king of uh, cups was coming in the reverse if if you can cups are intelligent in your emotions in the upright then fine but somebody's not because <clears throat> there's attacking going on something known about this king of cups a big time freaky manipulator in the negative of that card the devil well there you go <laughs> somebody boss is a devil somebody's ex is a devil just somebody in general is possessed with the devil uh, this is obsessiveness out here okay somebody's just trying to put you know attack somebody here somebody's able to stand up here and stand their ground and they know they can do it the devil's a defeated foe folks this is a fallen entity then all right um so this king of uh cups 
is dealing with some of your kink ups, deal with the devil, you can really use your intuition today. This is a, res I'm going to restrain you. I'm going to put these walls up. Somebody, somebody going to be judged and bent for this crap because justice was there for us today. Somebody knows about this energy that's already been going on. It's been communicated about some type of an attacking or something like that is here. Okay, well, the, uh, somebody's wounded. Also, I don't read them in the reverse, but they're coming out in the reverse. So I'll just look at them that way. But I hit energies both ways because it is going both ways. There's a fight out here. There's oppressive energy. It's, it's so, you know, for me as a reader, it just takes me back to the next card. Just for me as a reader, um, which is the nine of wands. There's already a bunch of freaking wands out here, which is a wounded warrior. Somebody is a warrior. If you can stand in the truth, uh, then you've got one over, uh, you know, a little slew foot here. That's freaking ridiculous with the nasty stuff that's going on. A couple people got chains on them. They ain't getting away from this stuff because they're bound to the devil. Okay, and they're they, they just intelligent in their own uh, mind, thinking that they can just pour on the little sweets here and manipulate something. It's causing nothing but a freaking oppression. Somebody cray cray. Yes, somebody can go prison. This is a prison card. Somebody's a kook. We know that somebody's a freaking kook out here. We'll just pull that out here since it was at the bottom of the deck. Give us more information. You pull that. <clears throat> somebody's stuck. They're stuck. They're, they're bound by the devil with the chains. Okay. And uh, they're stuck. Stuck and wounded in something very much sacrificial out here. In a very big freaking way. They're stuck. I just keep hearing they're stuck. They're stuck. They're stuck. I guess you're stuck devil came out I think it was yesterday yes it was yesterday morning as well you're stuck the children you're stuck around how how to return or some some type of a forgiveness situation there's a consequence out here when we see this card again this was last night we were looking at the past 24 hours there was a lot of thinking there's nostalgia here there's plotting that was there all these three cards was there in that past 24 hour um section of things when we were looking at it that there's plotting energy here <laughs> it's known it's known there's a lot of ones i something very much passionate out here there's death okay well there you go. There's death situations out here. Somebody plotting a death. Somebody already did plot some type of an attack. Jehovah stated that he was watching. He said, bring it. He's ready to destroy the destroyer. It's right there. Okay. Um, somebody's in unity for something. Somebody's in unity to put somebody in jail. This crap's already been going on. There's a decision. Somebody is at a crossroad. They're stuck. You're stuck. You're stuck. You're stuck. Something's over. It's transformed. There's been secrets. Something right up in your face. And so bit this big time government thing coming out here. Pride and conceit really big with these two cards as well. Uh, if you're new, I'm not going to break it down, but it's here with those two cards in a very big freaking way. Something very much piercing out here. And some people pierce somebody through sacrifice because there's, the cult is out here really freaking big. Okay. Somebody's just freaking sick and they're a nutcase in a freaking half. Well, something going to be positive because that's a force. Let's just see what's in the secret. <clears throat> oh my God. Jehovah, just take control today. Something's guided today in a very big way. It's guided. There's hope out here, folks, and something's bright. Because the devil's going away to jail. They'll reap what they sow children you know there has been children sacrifices it's also go back to children as well and then the rider and we have a child on a horse or you know a being on a horse we have a being on a horse here and then the sun is here it's so something can be right up in somebody's freaking face sun is out here twice uh the sun also is a star okay well somebody has been trying to catch somebody up somebody has stumbled on some information or is stumbling up on some information today there's some type of a surprise visitor for some of you all there's surprise news there's some type of a surprise information about something ha that has been invented this is i create somebody this is i use i believe i can use and create and i will do that well no you won't because you will be forced and bent <laughs> and you're a freak you can't do nothing at the bottom of the deck is the bouquet 
Okay, well, some, somebody's going to get some type of justice with them, some stuff, and some coop going to go away, then great. What's hidden is something around this children energy or somebody's got a childlike brain that card can represent that as well but somebody's stumbling up on some stuff or did now they're trying to you know create something and, and uh, manipulate ain't gonna happen because Jehovah's gonna Jehovah is going to um turn it around for the upright every single time <laughs> and you're stuck you always be stuck to the devil because you lost your soul Somebody's ex is out here. It's on the pillar. Okay. And the devil goes back to that kind of stuff as well. Remember somebody was jealous. They've been jealous. They've been trying to block somebody. The room. It was just showing itself to me just a minute ago. This is about opening up um, a welcoming element to somebody really is stuck here around some or did need to use your intuition because if you know somebody's you know in their pride and conceit today and they're trying to create this crap for love and romance and they're crazy in their head uh and they want you to open up and there's a gift here or a bribe you're going to be stuck yourself <clears throat> you have a city was watching somebody for somebody's energy somebody is trying to do something they are they're trying to return to, to, to be piercing but Jehovah said he was going to destroy the person that, you know, is doing something. They're stuck. They are stuck. Jehovah's just watching somebody. <laughs> Crazy freak. One did flip over. I knew I'd seen it. Yeah, a couple did. The priest card is here, and there's a bunch of money around some stuff as well. There is a lot of money. It's everywhere in this picture. Okay, the devil goes back to bank systems. There's secret money out here. And so it's known about, in a very big way, something's known about something. Okay? <laughs> There's inheritances, fraud issues, or what, you know, just something to do with money, bank systems, stuff like that. Somebody spiritual is out here. We had the word spiritual, uh, spir uh, spiritual or something like that came out. And the Pope came out last night as well. So, you know, let Yehovah Elohim bring it on out. Somebody can go jump. Okay, right here, folks. Something gonna be forced. Somebody getting judged now. I feel like somebody's speaking about this attack from the past energy. Okay, because this is a past card. Somebody's got soulmate out here. Somebody's child, or this is soulmate card as well. Somebody's family members out here involved in something. You know, we can just pick through my hands. And it's a shame, people, that we got people in our family that went crazy and nuts. They become our enemy. They aren't your family no more. If you're standing in the Most High and you were doing what He has you to do in this life, they are strangers to you now. They are nothing to do with you. If they went a wrong path, that was their choice. So there's nothing that you and I can do about it. They become an enemy to the Most High. So, you know, whatever side of the, um, you know, situation that you're on you either uh you know with Yehovah and he's for you and not against you and you will get the victory or you're on the other side you're getting judged for something or you're going crazy or you're going to lose your soul or whatever that is somebody did lose their soul around some matter a baby situation is here Okay, talk no more so proudly and ne let no arrogance come from your mouth for Jehovah Elohim is the Elohim of knowledge and by him actions are weighed. That's this energy right here. This is pride and conceit. One of the meanings is pride and conceit. The sun in this deck represents pride and ego. It's here. Okay, somebody's very proud in what they do and they're very arrogant. Um, somebody says nothing shall come between us. Well, somebody's a kook though. Because there's common interest somewhere, and somebody's ever loved and lost their freaking mind. And so those people in the negative, that's it. Nothing's going to come in between us, and they'll do anything and everything and try to figure out some stupidness around some stuff. They're kook. You're going to go to prison for something that you've done. There's that crying, 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 crying card. Stupidness. Stupid. Some type of big delight is here today. Yes, because the sun is out here. The sun is out here. Your cousin is involved in something. We have, fam we have soulmates out here. Somebody's family members involved some stupidness out here. 
uh, something happened at a bar, then something happened at a bar. <clears throat> An artist is here. Well, we have the industry here. We have somebody in the spotlight, front stage, and some, some artist energy is here, and something's here. Uh, the 11th house specifically is coming out, and that's the first card that jumped out. Okay, so if you are specific, I know that there's other, you know, uh, people born under Capricorn or um, Pisces, Leo, um, Scorpio, but specifically, Jehovah is bringing out a um, uh, Aquarius out here. Okay, so, or just that energy is just being brought out for Jehovah. Say so somebody does know something. Okay, something about somebody's ankles, their circulatory system. That house goes over that. This also goes back to your lymphatic system. Something about something being circulated then has been out here just in general if you ain't dealing with those signs. We all are dealing with these signs because the heaven is above the earth, right? Anyway, but if you are, you always bring it out. <clears throat> um, there's a, a sexual judgment out here. Well, there's been secret sex out here. There's, there's a, there's, there, yes, you hope it was addressing nasty in this last line. Because uh, the devil's out here. There's some type of, the eighth house can go back to the gutter. Somebody has done something really nasty, even to children, people. Even to children. Um, examine energy is here or to search or to seek for something okay something's found today as well there's an examination around that situation something's being tried out here with somebody you know somebody's gonna be tried in the court of law and go to jail that way as well anyway somebody had had walls up um, because of the past hurts and somebody's over something now today if that's manipulation being said, again, you're really going to have to use your intuition. Something's going to be forced anyway, even if it's a trick. Somebody, if somebody's trying something out here and inventing something out here for some of your cases, then you really got to use your intuition. Okay. A car dealer energy. We had all kinds of stuff about travel yesterday. You are loved came out last night. And there's the FBI. It's here. It came out in a totally different deck yesterday. Pride goes before destruction. Somebody's out here talks real haughty, and uh, they're sure of themselves, and they're proud, and they're arrogant, and you hope it's weighing somebody's actions out here, okay? And stormy water's out here on somebody because they're kook. So pride goes before destruction, and a haughty spirit before a fall. Better it is to be of a humble spirit with the lowly than to divide the spoil with the proud. And there was a lot of, of spoil here somebody's it, it, somebody's boss did that stole something murdered for something and then they got other people involved in stuff because they're all right here okay and then they all divided the spoil okay and now a destruction comes because Jehovah has been really bringing out that he was going to destroy some people uh, something about whenever your hands folded inside of mine, it was a perfect fit. Again, some people got some type of a surprise lover communication, but somebody's pride and ego is just, my God, they're wanting somebody to open up. But some, some of you all are going to be able to open up because somebody is going to go to prison for some stuff that's taking place. So again, you're just going to have to use your intuition because everybody's situation is different. But somebody very prideful is out here in this reading. Pride, pride. Right, and it's out here in two carts because they're facing prison, they're trying to do something here. <clears throat> Destroy them today, you hope. Destroy them. The letter B is here. There's a joy here, yeah. Well, there is something is positive anyway because the sun's out here in a very big way. This is a victory card, and there is a sure success because you hope it's stated so. Um, because a lot of this stuff is past that's been going on for a long time. This is this go back to time. Uh, somebody's just stuck. They ain't getting out of it. They're on chains. This goes back to somebody's nutrition that's been out here. We have children, you know. Oh, actually, I caught on the news the other day stuff about formula and stuff like that. So just in general, the government is also dealing with baby formula and stuff. It's still showing here within matters. Um, I love you, Hobo, because it just speaks in such a profound way. Um, but there's a baby situation. This is um, fertility. And uh, so, anyway, a child is here and a baby energy is here. So, again, it still goes back to that formula stuff as well. But in general, we do have children sacrificing going on. That's not okay. Okay, you're going to go to jail and you're going to go to hell for that crap. Somebody's get forced out here. So, we, we look for, you know, that moment when you get to go away and you can cry your little boohoo tears in jail for the rest of your days okay there's a judgment card there's a judge out here until next time shalom